Hey YouTubers, good morning, Rob Mave. Guys, this is my little radio, Reticus P115. It plays MP3s, it also records. It's shortwave radio, AM, FM radio. But it's basically used to play MP3s that I download from YouTube. I've got over a thousand. So this video, I want to show you how you can use the sleep function on your Reticus V115 so you can put it on right before you go to sleep. And if you have a, a recording that's on for a long time, an hour or so, it can play up to 90 minutes and then it'll automatically go off by itself. A lot of people have had difficulty uh, accessing the function on the, uh, on the radio. I've got it set to a song by Kevin McLeod. McLeod. He doesn't, uh, I won't get a, a YouTube uh, copyright strike because he allows people to use his recording so long as you give him credit. Uh, Kevin McLeod's a great guy. Um, so here's what's going to happen. I'm going to show you two things. One, if you look here, there's a, a letter A. And if you press the, uh, the, the menu button, that letter A is going to change to 1 or F or R. And we'll go back to 1. When it's on, on 1, when it plays a song, it will repeat the song. When it's on F or A, or it will go to the next song on your file. When it's on R, it will do a random shuffle. It will play uh, songs at random. It won't be in sequence. The reason I'm telling you that is you may have a song that is not very long, but you want to repeat it. And in order to do that, you'd have to have that little button on one. So I listen to something that's over an hour on MP3 and I, I play it for like 30 or 40 minutes and let it go off automatically. But if you had a song that was only like 10 minutes or something and you wanted to play it for a long time, you'd want to be able to repeat it. And by doing that, you'd first of all need to have the radio set to number one. Now, to get to how to access the sleep function, it's very simple. You're going to be using the menu button and you're going to be using the, the right button and the middle button, which is the play button. So once again, you have the menu button and then you're going to be pressing the right button because this is a left button, right button, middle button, or play button. And then you're going to be pressing this, this button here, the middle button. And when you press it, you're going to hold it for more than uh, one and a half seconds. So we're going to put our finger on the menu button. And this is to access the sleep function. So press down. And it says auto power. Now don't press anything. Wait for a couple seconds. It's going to give you a time now. Now go to the third button here on the right and hold it down and you can change the number, or I should say keep pressing, and you can change the number of minutes. It goes up to 90. If you want to decrease it, you would press the far left button. Let's say you want to only go for 20 minutes. Now, after you set the amount you want, press the middle button, and now you've set it for the amount of time this would play that song. We'll, we'll do this one more time real quick. Let's go to the, the menu button and we're going to hold it down. Now take it off as soon as it's out of power. And once it goes to a time, we can use this button to change it up or down, or this one's down. But the one on the far right is up. It'll go to 90. You won't go to 70. And when you're finished selecting the amount of time, press the middle button and you automatically have set your time. So now, when you press play, this song is going to continue playing for 70 minutes. It automatically go off. And then the sequence will be erased and you have to do it again if you want to do it again next night. So I have a song I listen to, uh, or, or some music, ambient music, to help me to go to sleep. It's like a 60 minute recording and I just plug it in for 30 or 40 minutes every night. It's very helpful to go to sleep. This is a great little gadget here. It records not only the radio, it also records your voice. You can put this in your pocket. It has shortwave, AM, FM, and you can hook this up to your computer to uh, edit or make and 
files or folders and subfolders so you can organize your music a lot better easier it's only 20 25 dollar radio it's a really a pretty one the best thing i purchased last year uh, i've had uh, so much enjoyment getting uh, music from this little gadget also i've been able to hook it up to my car even though i have an old car that has a cassette player i have an adopter that will play into my cassette player this is like a two minute song you see it's repeated now so I showed you how to uh, repeat your songs, or if you want to do random shuffle, use the letter R, uh, and also how to access the sleep function. So I hope this was something enjoyable. Um, I recently had a commenter on one of my previous videos said, you need to do this video over. You, you're, you're chatty and you're uh, disorganized. <laughs> so hopefully, hopefully I wasn't too chatty on this one or too disorganized. And uh, you want to, I'll leave a link to this on Amazon or else you can get them on eBay, anywhere you want to get them as cheap as you can. But this is an excellent device. I've been playing with it uh, daily, using it uh, for over a year now. And it's worked flawlessly and it's it does so many different things very well. So that's my review, or let's see, not a review, it's more or less letting you know how to access the sleep function on the Retech S V115. I'll leave a link to the little consumer uh, user manual I found online. You can uh, access it if you if you have this radio and you don't have your manual anymore. All right, guys. Hope this was something helpful to you. Put a new videos every single week. Been doing it for 13 or 14 years. Got over 900 videos on my channel and a bunch of cool people I feature on my channel. No relation to me. They would not anyway. <laughs> and a bunch of playlists and put stuff on you all the time. All right, guys. Uh, take care. See you out there.